the Holy Ghost. It goes like this. When Christ was on the earth, he promised he would send the Holy Ghost to comfort us, our true eternal friend. The Holy Spirit whispers with a still small voice. He testifies of God in Christ and makes our heart rejoice. And when we are confirmed by the sacred priesthood power, the Holy Ghost is given to us to guide us every hour. Oh, may I always listen to that still small voice, and with his light I'll do what's right each time I make a choice. From this song you have learned God teaches us what's right and wrong. He promised he would send the Holy Ghost to comfort us. You have learned the Holy Ghost will guide us every hour. Listen to the still small voice, and nothing will go wrong. He will help us to choose the right. You will learn a lot of wonderful things from this song. How I've gotten help by the Holy Ghost is I was playing tag with my friends, and there were three concrete stairs. I jumped them, and I heard a voice saying, Don't jump the stairs. I, land, I fell and scraped my knee. Another time is I had a bad dream, and I went to my mom, and she said, Go pray about it. So I did. After I prayed for five minutes, I was crying and sobbing. And when I stopped, when I ended the prayer, I felt joy and I forgot what I was scared of. Another time is I was seeing the Spirit of God in church. And I felt joy in my heart and I just wanted to never stop singing that song. Getting baptized was the happiest thing that ever happened to me. I hope it's the happiest day for you too. Elder Robert D. Hale said, Our testimony is a knowledge of who we are, a child of God. We can each gain a testimony of the truth through the Holy Ghost. People often ask me, How do you know? How can you know that God and Jesus Christ live? Well, there seems to be no exact formula for which each of us receives a testimony. There does seem to be a pattern. Though prayer is important in gaining a testimony, we cannot merely ask in prayer for a testimony except to be given immediately to us. Testimony comes from a prayer and from studying the scriptures and applying them in our lives. There seems to be moments in each of our lives when we can be given the knowledge that God lives and that Jesus is the Christ. I hope that you never get tempted away from the Spirit. I love you and I miss you. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen.